Ship, Cooper Dames, Beauty Dame, Forget the Gamer, and today I'm going to be showing you how to make your own Game Boy emulator. So, this is going to be a very simple tutorial. So, just wait about like two minutes and it should work. Okay, so go to sprites and you want to make your first sprite just be a blank screen. Now, I promise this works. I'll show it working at the very end. And you just have to set this to 144 uh, 140. I'm pretty sure that's the width of the Game Boy screen. And then you just do this as a no, just do it as white. That will be the color of your screen. Okay. And then we just go to objects and you make it you object zero. It has to be object zero. And then do add event and do a, a step. And you have to, this will make it display the stuff. So you do a slash slash and then you go down and you do draw, uh, what was it again? Draw background and then you do bg underscore screen. Okay, how do we do this again? Okay. And then zero zero. Now that's all you gotta do. So then go back and go back again and go to backgrounds and do BG screen. And there. Now make this 144, 140. And make this a white screen too. And then this isn't required, but I always like to rename my stuff. Okay, and then make a room, set to 144, 140, and make sure the FPS is at 60, because or else it won't look smooth, and then you have that there. Now, guys, that's all you need. Now, I'm going to continue, and I'm going to show you this working. Okay, so here it is working. Oh, it actually is working. Okay, so let's play this. It's a little laggy. I'm just playing Pokemon Yellow. Okay, my name is... Let's do Lim. Okay, so I think this is showing that it's working. His name is... Nachos. Okay, so I'm just going to show you guys that this is fully working. Okay, so you see I can walk around. By the way, the controls are real simple. Okay, voila. I think that's where I'm going to leave this off. So thanks for watching your creepy lemons. And I'll see you in the next video.